gamers, welcome to my boulders. So I thought I'd start preparing for Mario Bros. Wonder by playing some new Super Mario Bros. Now I got a challenge to myself, I have a bunch of challenges that uh, I completed a long time ago. However, I want to go for gold medals on all of them, so here's the deal. Anything that I have a gold medal for, I'll just play it. Anything I don't have a gold medal for, I'm going to go for a gold. So let's start with Time Attack Trial. Just, to, just got to dash to the goal in 21 seconds or less. Now I've already done this one, so I'm just going to do it just to see how it goes. It's probably going to be pretty easy to start. So yeah, this is literally just run forward. Don't stop running ever. Okay. So yeah, that's basically just going to be what's going to go down today. Uh, it, I feel like it's going to be kind of refreshing because um, I have not looked at these challenges or attempted them. I think since the game originally came out, so I remember virtually none of them. It's going to all feel kind of new. That was really bad. I slowed down there. But that's okay. I already got the gold medal, so I don't have to get it now. Oh, we still got gold. Okay. 20.77. Cool. So up next, Acorn Plane Speed Run. Got to reach the goal in uh, 53 seconds. Wow. And I've done 56 seconds in the past, so I got to do 53 seconds or less. All right. Let's do this thing. So I'm going to guess no power-ups is going to have to be the strat here. So far, this is pretty self-explanatory. Not too difficult. Okay, pretty easy so far. Sliding faster? Sliding faster, I guess. Ooh, okay. So I think there I just need to land on the brown block and then just kind of jump. And then I should be safe. There shouldn't be an issue. Now, thankfully, this is, you know, New Super Mario Bros. Patterns don't change or anything. So basically, I just got to kind of learn the patterns for this. And that's going to be how I get through them. If I can figure out the patterns, I can probably clear the level. Okay. Okay, that works. That works. That works. I'll take it. little sketch, but I'll take it. Oh! No! Oh! Oh my god, 51 seconds. Okay, I'm very happy with that. I feel like I really only slowed down like maybe once or twice that whole time. I mean, that, that was pretty good. I'll take it. So we've got full speed ahead. Reach the goal in 40 seconds or less. Okay. So if you never played the challenge uh, levels in this game, they're not all going to be just run fast. That's just the sections I'm doing right now. They will actually change up. Uh, once we get to, like, different segments. But for now, these are all just, like, speed sections. Just go as fast as possible. So I got to do this in 30 seconds or less, basically. Oh! Okay, small jump? Not quite what I meant. What if I just stayed low to the ground, actually? That might be better. Let's just stay low to the ground. Yeah, we're just chilling down here. That's a lot safer. Makes way more sense to do that. Oh, my. Oh! Ah! Okay. Huh! Ah! Okay. We missed it! How do we miss it? We went full blast! Oh my god. Well, we must have gotten at least a high score. Damn, we barely missed it. So we're really gonna have to cook to make this. Come on! Come on! Oh, that was so close! Wow, so I really think the way to get that gold is to really utilize the hills. Like, you have to fly down the hills. So I could just start crouching down them and see if I go faster that way. Because, I mean, running down them is pretty fast too, but maybe that's kind of the strat. Oh! Oh my god! By 0.06 seconds! Yes! Oh my god, that one was close. Alright, I feel good about that. Yeah, so that was basically the strat. Just hold down on the hills. You slide a little bit faster. I didn't think it was actually that much faster, but apparently it is. Now, Stone Eye Desert Dash. I've already gotten gold in this, but I'll go ahead and just try it. Reach the goal in 80 seconds or less. Okay. I believe this was the first level in uh, World 2. From what I can remember. Oh, wow. That's, that's significantly much more complex. Ooh, yo, star coin. Gotta get the star coin for some reason. Don't know why. Ah! Okay, well, that honestly might have been a gold if that didn't happen. Because it's 56 seconds. That's not, a, that's actually a pretty easy gold. Like, if I just didn't mess up at the end, I probably would have gotten it, barely. So next we got the Boo Ballet. Reach the goal in 40 seconds or less. Oh, God. I gotta do this in 15 seconds? Okay, so this is just going to require... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no, it's one of these levels. I remember these. These are really difficult. Um, this is just going to require some muscle memory, just playing it a bunch, really getting used to the jumping. That was pretty close. That was close. Okay. If I can get past that last one, then I think we're okay, because that's not that bad. 
almost debating on like, maybe you don't jump there. Maybe you just have to go. That just doesn't seem right. I don't think so. I think you have to jump there. Let's just try going. Screw it. Yeah, okay. So you definitely, you have to do a very, very tiny jump. And I think also a spin jump. That jump is so hard. Oh my god, it's so much harder than it looks. Yeah! Let's go! All right, 14.8. That's what I'm talking about. So next we've got the Boo Ballet Encore. Oh, great, an encore. Reach the goal in 40 seconds or less. Oh, while well, in mini form. And I've done this in apparently 16 seconds before. Hmm, okay. This one is honestly going to be very different. <laughs> Just the mechanics of, of uh, Mini Mario is so different. So that jump needs to be really, really delayed. I think it's the exact same pattern. I'm just using Mini Mario now. Let's go. I can't believe I got that in like three tries. I thought that would take way longer. Oh my God, that, that was easier. I mean, I guess it makes sense. Like, you know, Mario is a lot smaller, but still. Okay, Icicle Skating. Uh, reach the goal 100 seconds or less. Ooh, this looks fun. Frosted Glacier 5. Yeah, this can be a fun one. So I know that going downhill is fast, so we're going to do that a lot. Basically as often as we can. Ah! That was a little scary. Ah! Okay, that works. Oh! Okay, okay. That's not that bad. It, it definitely, it's a lot longer than I anticipated it being. It's very long, but we could definitely do that. That's not that bad. Yeah. Okay, that works. Yeah. Ah. Trying to avoid slants. Oh my God, this level goes on for so long. <laughs> Woo, okay, up the pipe. That was perfect. Oh, I gotta do stairs though, don't I? Oh God, okay, go, 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 go. All right, that was way too close. Oh my God, 72 seconds. Barely got the gold, but we got it. Wow. That was a really fun one. Man, I really hope Super Mario Bros. Wonder has a challenge mode like this, because I freaking love the challenges. I think they're so much fun. Actually, what would be really cool is um, co-op challenges, because you could do, you know, four-player co-op in the game. Why not have co-op challenges? I think that would be really damn cool. Especially if you can do it online. Oh, man. Be going hard on that. Okay, Hucket Hustle. Defeat all the Hucket Crabs and reach the goal in 85 seconds or less. Okay, wow. My record's 77? Jeez. Okay, gotta defeat every Hucket Crab. All right. Oh, my God. All right, so, yeah, this one, again, like I said, I think for a lot of these, it's just gonna be trial and error, just figuring out where exactly to jump, and then just executing. Oh, his damn rock got in the way. Wow, that one's, like kind of hard. See, it's kind of difficult to, like, try to predict where the crab's gonna end up because the ground elevation keeps changing. Let me just do, like, a little baby jump. Okay. That was a lot better. Ah, oh, damn. Okay. All right. So I think I need to do a little tiny jump off of the water, then I'll probably be able to clear that pretty easily. Oh my god, dude, his damn rock! Okay, right in the middle. Right in the middle. That's when you jump. All right. Little baby jump, okay. No, ah, oh, okay. Let's just let's just keep going. Okay, that's not good. Not that many hucket crabs after that. Okay, okay. That that really does not seem that bad. So basically, jump in the middle of the geyser, and then we'll be good. Like right there. Yes. Okay, that's consistent. Right in the middle. Little baby jump there, and then at this point, it's not that bad. Okay, that was pretty bad though. But, no. All right, this this is definitely doable. This doesn't feel that hard. Okay, good. Just fall. Just falling there is good. Dude, we were so close. We were so close that time. But at least we got the hilarious 69 number. So, thank God. Start laughing really hard. Ha 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 ha! I, slow, I slowed down at the end. That was really the main hurdle, was slowing down at the end. So, yeah, that's totally possible. Come on, here we go. This is the one. Please. Oh! Yeah! Let's go! 66.46. Woo! Oh, that was satisfying. 
Oh man, that was a really satisfying one to get. Woo, that was hard. That one was really difficult. Really, the, the challenge was the fact that the Hucket Crabs throw the rocks and they jump. So you have to really like memorize their, their patterns, how they're gonna jump, when they're gonna jump. That was hard. We've got Mini Mountaineer. Reach the goal in 100 seconds or less without touching the ground in mini form. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, this is kind of nuts. So I gotta do it in 25 seconds with, with Mini Mario. Oh, I gotta do this in 25 seconds? Okay, this is gonna take some attempts. A few moments later. Dude, what the fuck? How do you do this in 25 seconds? I mean, that felt, wow. How do you do that in 25 seconds? Okay, I have some ideas to speed it up a little bit, but damn, I might actually have to watch a video on how to do that, because that is pretty nuts. Hey, 25 seconds, holy sh You gotta be flying. Okay. So I guess if you were, maybe that's what you're supposed to do. You have to wall jump and then hit the Koopa there. Okay, let's try that. I always have to forget, like, the spin jump gives me so much extra horizontal distance. That is incredibly useful. So I have to try to keep that in mind. Yes, okay. So, okay. Um, I don't think I'm gonna be able to hit that first Koopa. Not that fast anyway. I mean, maybe I need to do a spin jump after bouncing off the bullet bill to get just a little extra height. Actually, I have an idea. Okay, what if we do... See, I tried to, like, pull back, but that... That doesn't really work. God, 25... I think I'm just gonna watch a video, because I really have no idea. This seems ridiculous. A few moments later... Okay, this one, I'm overcomplicating it. This is not nearly as complex as I thought it was gonna be. It's still gonna take some attempts, I think, but... Yeah, this should be more than doable. So you do actually bounce off all these things. We are gonna wall jump here. I missed that, but yeah. Okay, let's see if I can get the general premise down. I gotta get used to Mini Mario, too. I mean, Mini Mario in the air, trying to bounce off stuff, is not as easy as you would think. He's very, very floaty. Like, it's not bad controls, it's just very different. Okay, there we go. We made it up. Made it up very fast, actually. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, that was so good! Not quite good enough, but it was very, very close. So I gotta do that just a little bit faster. It's the middle of the stage that's very challenging. Oh, this is good. This is a good one. No, nah, I ruined it. Shit. Okay, but that's that's it. Okay, I can do this. More moments later. That is so difficult. It's so much harder than it looks. Oh my god. Because it's like, you are going the complete opposite direction, and then out of nowhere, you have to, like, go the complete, the other direction. It's so disorienting. Come on, make it! Yes! Get up! Get the f*** up! Oh my god, I need the other bullet bill! I don't have it! Okay, this is still not the right solution. Let me watch the video again. I have to do, like, exactly what the video did. Okay, okay, okay. Come on! No! No, that was it! That was the run! Oh my god, that was the run! Shit. Okay, so you can make that cycle. But holy hell, it's tight. Oh my god, that cycle is tight. Oh, but that was... I had it. I literally had it. I just messed up my movement at the end. Just turn around. Okay, yeah. You have to turn around fast as shit. That's the cycle. Okay. Because then I can get up here. Boom! Yes! ho <laughs> ho! Yeah! 21 seconds! Yeah! Woo! Oh my god, that was so difficult. Alright, Luncheon Urchins. How many of these are three? Are they the rest of these three stars? Oh my god, there's four stars. I'm scared. There's five stars? Holy sh**. Man, I was struggling on the three star one. Oh god. Okay, let's see what we have. Luncheon, or Lurchin Urchins. Uh, reach the goal in 75 seconds or less. Okay. Um, lots of urchins. Honestly, doesn't seem that bad, but hey. Okay. Honestly, let's just do a practice run just to kind of get the eye a good familiarity with the stage. Alright, yeah. This doesn't seem 
that bad, honestly. Okay. That's a little annoying. Oh my god, that's scary. <laughs> ah! Ooh, okay. Okay, now I take it back. This might actually be a little difficult. This is nice, though, because... God, New Super Mario Bros. is such just a... Easy, stale, boring franchise. I love playing the mods for it, but just playing the vanilla game, it's so hard for me to do now, because I've just played them so, so many times. They're really not that interesting. That, that jump is surprisingly hard. So, it's just so nice, because, like, that they actually have something at least difficult. Um, it, it's a nice change of pace. Okay, now, this part... This part doesn't seem that bad. It's mostly just learn... Um, where the blocks are gonna be, I think. Okay, yeah, I gotta bounce. I think if I bounce off the Koopa, I'll be fine there. Okay, so... Bounce off the Koopa. Yep. I should not have spun- the, sp the spin jump was completely unnecessary. Okay, but what do you do after that? So you bounce off the Koopa. Then you keep running across here. Okay. The trees. You do a bit of this. Okay. Uh, don't do that. That's really slow. I just go fast here. I just run fast. Okay. Okay, this seems pretty doable. This does not seem too bad. There's just a few tricky jumps around the beginning. The ending, I honestly think, is probably easier. Which is kind of nice. Because, like, that jump's a little tight. This Even these jumps are a little tight. Okay, so do that. Bounce off of this. Okay. I slowed down a teeny tiny bit because I got scared, but otherwise that was really good. Oh my god. Okay, that that's just sh So, that, I mean, I know I can, I already know I can clear that part without getting stuck in the water. So that should be pretty doable. Okay, yes, yeah, so a little baby jump. Okay, that that's actually a good stride. I can do that. Okay. That's pretty consistent. That's not that hard to replicate. I, I wall jumped off of that. How the fuck? How? Whatever, we'll just keep going. We just got a practice level in general, I think, before really mastering it. Okay. If I jump short, I, I all I gotta do is spin jump. That's it. Then I'll get a little extra height and I'll be fine. Okay, we outran that. Good. Then just go fast as shit here. Just run, run, run. Is that good enough? Oh my god, that wasn't good enough. Okay, it was close though, because I think we need to get 60 seconds. Hmm. Okay, so honestly, what I feel like I need to do there is figure out how to outrace that water jet at the beginning, because that slows me down so much. It slows me down a lot. I'm going to watch the video, see what the person does. So I'm kind of curious. So, the jet that I was talking about where I lose time, you can actually avoid it, but that is going to be a tight-ass jump. That is going to be hard. If I can do that then I'm probably going to be good to get... Oh, it's only 61 seconds. I'll probably be fine. I'll be able to clear the whole thing. So I'll just have to practice that. Try to get as good as I can at it. Ooh, that is really hard to do. Oh my god. Um, I'm just going to keep doing the run because I want to make sure that I really have it down. And then it's just getting that jump down. That last jump. Okay. Um, This probably is not going to be good enough, but it's going to be a little bit better than last time. Yeah, okay, so it's a slightly faster. I really have to do that, man. That's crazy. I have to avoid that water geyser. That's what lost me time. That's insane. Wow, that is hard. Like, I have to do it. Um, I'm going to watch the video again, because I don't know how the f*** he got enough speed to do it. Okay, so that's kind of like what I'm supposed to do, but I have to jump. I can't even go back down here. Um, I have to jump, like, way earlier. Well, not early, necessarily. I gotta jump, like, right off of the edge and then do, like, that. That's basically what I have to do. That's... That is such a tight jump. Holy crap. Well, I think the easiest way to get up there is I gotta kind of stay on the palm trees. Like, if, I, if I'm not on the palm trees from the beginning, it's really hard to get myself up. So, we're gonna hit up those palm trees basically as soon as we can. Starting now. Yep. And then there. Oh, I did it! I kind of did it! That was faster? That Okay, I almost had it. That was really close. Wow, that is so hard. Okay, we did it again. Oh, shit. Okay, oh, I, I really choked there. But maybe, maybe it'll be fast enough still. I slowed down a teeny tiny bit twice. 
So I don't know if that'll be good enough or not, but we'll find out. Uh, I don't know. I'm not feeling good about that. Dude, those slowdowns might have costed me pretty bad. Come on. Uh... Oh, no! I hit the bottom! What the... Oh, my God. That was so preventable. Okay, well, I, I mean, I could definitely do it now. For sure. Like, I'm not nervous about it. Like, that, that jump? I think I kind of got it down at this point. Yes! Yeah! Let's go! 60.77! Yes! Oh my god, <laughs> that was so hard. It was really just that one jump. It wasn't as hard as the mini Mountaineer, but that that was still pretty damn hard. Penguin versus Torpedo. Pass through the goal ring in penguin form in 60 seconds or less. Ooh, this looks fun. Oh, this is scary. Oh my god, this is kind of scary, actually. Okay, I mean, that was pretty good. Um, I did bonk like one time, and I think that's why I didn't get it. I mean, that doesn't seem that bad. Way faster than last time. Okay. Oh, man. Okay. I'm Because I think I need to, like, literally... If I can outrace those Torpedo Teds, I'm probably going to be able to do it. Easier said than done, though. Yeah. You know what's, what I think what really makes this difficult is, like, trying to pass these Torpedo Teds. Like, they're in just the most awkward spot, so we can't really do it easily. But if I could... That would be great. Okay, so I think I actually want to head down because I can probably make some actual good coverage at the bottom. Also, the swimming is very awkward. It's like, it's fine. It's better than just normal Mario swimming in this game, but it's not great still. Should I just like, I should like head all the way to the bottom? No, not yet. I need to gain speed here. Head to the bottom now after this part. You head to the... oh, God damn, that's hard. I might watch a video on this too. I don't I don't really know what to do here. If I could just figure out like what the, the route is, then I could probably do it with practice. Also, just a random note for people that mod this game. You know what would be really, really cool? Adding challenges. That was bad. I oh, know. That would be really sick though. Like actually adding challenges to your custom levels. I think that would add even more replay value to your levels. Right? That, that'd be cool. Okay, I'm gonna watch what the fuck to do, because I, I don't know. A few moments later. I see what to do now. Okay, I figured something like that was doable. Okay, so the video I was watching was using Toad. We're gonna try using Toad as well. And yeah, I, I kind of like, I think I see exactly what I need to do here. Okay, here we go. This is what I do. Oh, shit, that's hard. Okay, okay. That, okay, I, I understand what I need to do now. I need to not swim. I need to basically stay in that spot, but not swim that fast yet. That's what I gotta do. I gotta pass that Yes! Come on. And then down. Oh, yeah! Oh, that one was satisfying. They've all been so satisfying to get golds in. Woo, wow, you gotta swim fast for that. Oh man, I'm really glad I switched to Toad, because I do think his his smaller hitbox made a tiny difference. Probably not a huge difference, but... Alright, slick slopes and bullet bills. Reach the goal in 65 seconds or less. Oh, this looks fun. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll keep using Toad. Like, why not? Might as well. Okay, jump either really early there or really late. I'll have to figure that out. Probably double jump there. Probably our best option. So here, one, two, yeah, double jump, bounce off the bullet bill. Okay, cool. Okay, note to self, do not slide all the way down the mountain to the bottom because there's a dead end. I have to double jump here. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, and I really need to bounce off of the waddle wing as well just so I can get that bullet bill bounce afterwards. So I've not figured out the exact height for those jumps, but I, I know double jump's definitely necessary. Yeah, that's the thing, like, it's not a full jump. It's not a, it is definitely not a full jump there, but it is not like a half jump. It's like a three quarters jump. Sure. Okay, jump up here, hit the Koopa. So I gotta hit the Koopa. 
Okay, the Koopa disoriented me because he went from left to right because he was turning around. Wasn't really expecting that. Okay, that's kind of like just the right jump for that part. Sure, I guess that's the fastest route, at least for now. Okay, little baby jump. Yep. Okay. Okay. Oh, pig out! Okay, we made it. We're good. Oh, sh I let go of down too early. Okay, that's fine. That was a little slow anyway. You could probably do that part a little bit faster. I just tried to... I was trying to... I need to stop trying to bounce off of them. That's not necessary. Although this one that's coming up is... Okay, small jump. I mean, that, that was better. Definitely could have been faster, but that was better. Okay, hold down the whole time. Is that good enough? Oh my god, it was almost good enough. Oh, that was so close. Now, was it 52 or 51? I think it was 51 seconds I had to get. Okay, I mean, yeah, there were definitely moments that I could have done faster. I basically just need to do that again, but more optimized. A few moments later. Oh, it was good enough! It was good enough! Exactly 51! Yeah! Wow! That was so close to not working, though. Oh, my God. That was a clunky run. Oh, my God. Wow. Right on the dot. I don't think I'll ever do that again. Right on the goddamn dot. The Haunted Propeller. Okay. Uh, reach the goal ring in propeller form. Oh, my God. I remember this one. This one is so freaking hard. I'm probably going to watch a video on how to do this one as well, but I'll only give it some attempts first. Yeah, this one is hard as hell. Like, trying to do it fast is hard. Okay. I mean, I think this first part, I, I have a pretty good idea on how to do it. But after that, uh, I don't know. I'm not sure yet. So I need to do a big jump. I cannot do two small jumps. One big jump. That's how you get across that one big ass jump. Okay. A big jump, and then bam, okay. Then head to the right, okay. Okay, that, this is slow, so big jump. F okay, okay. That is very hard, holy shit. Kinda wish I was mini. I don't, there is no mini propeller, but that would be nice. Okay, big jump. Yeah, I don't think it really matters if it's a big or small jump, which is kind of cool. Fuck, man, that's really hard. Because I was trying to avoid the, the boo because it was going to the right, so I moved right and still got hit. Okay. Keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. Ah! What the fuck? What is that pattern? Okay. Um. Ah! Oh my god, I got it! The first time clearing it, I got it. Yes! Oh man, I was worried about getting stuck on that, because that is one of those levels where I feel like I could have gotten stuck for a while. Wow, that was a hard one. That was actually kind of fun. Like, once you really get the flow of how it works, it was pretty fun. Dude, I just realized I'm in the four stars now. Okay, flippers crossing. Reach the goal in 70 seconds or less. Okay, I don't have to kill the flippers, thank God. Okay, so this one is definitely just going to be, a, again, a lot of trial and error, figuring out how... High, they're gonna jump. They jump a lot higher than the Hucket Crabs, that's for sure. So then you do like a large ass jump for that. Okay. So large ass jump for that, then just I think jump down or just fall down. I think falling down will be enough to avoid that. Big jump, fall down. Yep, okay. Ah! I'm scared he's gonna pull out a snowball. Oh shit. Oh shit. stay down. Okay. What am I doing? Why did I do that? That was like perfect. Oh my god. Woo! Okay. Hit that. Oh, yeah, la, 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 la. Ah! Okay. I think he's gonna jump. I'm just gonna go f forward and see if he jumps that, because he might just jump. Okay, he's gonna jump this. I'm honestly kind of stunned I didn't die from the snowball there. I think he's gonna jump. Oh. Not this one. The one coming up. Oh! But I think this thing's gonna jump, right? I don't even know what happened there. I'm just gonna keep going. So 55, I'm probably not gonna get 55 seconds. I slowed down way too much. Yeah, what, what time are we gonna get? So that's also good to know. Do not jump at the end. At the very, very end, just run. That's it. Just run, run, run. 
Okay. It's just that one flippers I gotta figure out. Then everything else I think I pretty much have. Okay, there we go. That was perfect. Okay. Much better. Little baby jump. Yep, baby jump. Perfect. Okay. All right. Oh! Oh! It was good enough! Oh my god, it was good enough. Okay. Oh, I wasn't supposed to jump there, but it worked. I got really nervous at the end because I couldn't remember what I was supposed to do. <sighs> nice. All right. 54. What was what was even the uh, time? 55 seconds? I think I was supposed to get 55 or better. Or was it 56? I do not remember. Okay, rickety sprint. Let's try this one. Reach the goal in 75 seconds or less. All right. Dude, I love the ones where you just have to run through the levels. I think they're the most fun. It's so much fun just, like, like figuring out the best path and just getting better and better the more times you do it. Okay, um... Ah! <laughs> Actually worked. I guess that was fast. I don't know. Oh no, f***ing Lekitu? That's the last thing I need right now. Dude, thank god that widescreen- Oh, it's it strong. I was gonna say, thank god widescreen exists because I can look so much farther in the horizon. Thank god. Hmm. So, I need to either go over the question mark block or under and avoid the Koopa. Because the Koopa messes that cycle up. Because it's definitely- It's actually not as hard as it looks. Like, it looks very difficult, but... The Koopa messes up the cycle, as usual. It's like a recurring theme for these challenges. Yeah, okay. So, that one basically just don't hit the Koopa. And then I have to do a full jump, and then I should be okay. Because there I let go of the jump button a little early. That's still really hard. Honestly, that is still a pretty hard jump. I, maybe if I spend more time on the left side, the platform will go up a little bit more, which makes it a little more possible to get up there without having to slow down. Because, like, that part I cannot slow down. I can't use a Koopa to kill the plant. I just gotta blast through it. Yeah, so I need to I need to somehow spend more time on the left side. I don't even know how I did that the first time. Just, like, somehow blaze through without even paying attention. The spin jump... If I use the spin jump a little bit earlier... Or... I don't know, it's hard to say. It's really hard to say. I think spin jumping across the middle is how you get across. I might actually watch a video on this one, because I don't know what I did the first time. <laughs> like that, that is a really, really tight jump. Okay, I'm going to watch a video. That is a tight-ass jump. A few moments later. Okay, I think I see what to do. And then, honestly, as long as I can clear this one jump I'm struggling with, the rest of the level really is not that hard. There's going to be a couple of tricky jumps here and there, but most of, for the most part, it's really not that bad. Okay, so I see what I was doing wrong now. Okay, now we just got to focus. Okay. So, yeah, I see exactly what I was what I needed to do. I just needed to do basically a small jump at that first section. Then I get more time on the left side. It goes up a little bit. I can clear it no problem. Okay, small jump here. Yeah, see, that's all you got to do. Okay, that's not that bad. So, big jump over the big uh, green mushroom as well, at the end. Yeah! Let's go! Yeah! All right! Ah, I can't believe how much fun I'm having with this f***ing game. Like, New Super Mario Bros. Z was one of the most stale video games of all time, but goddamn, the challenges are so much fun! Okay, no cash dash. What is this? Reach the goal in 70 seconds less without collecting a single coin. Ooh. Sounds fun. Usually I like to collect all the coins. Oh god. Okay, you know what? <laughs> this actually looks kind of hard. Holy crap. Okay. Getting a bit of a feel for this one. Um. Yeah, this one looks kind of tough. I'm not gonna lie. This one looks tough. Let's see if we can get a bit more of a flow here. It could probably just run straight. I mean, this part, I don't like that part at all. Ah! Darn it. Hmm. I almost wonder if you can jump both of those steps in just one jump. That, that might be doable. Okay, so I see what I need to do there. I need to jump off of that second one. I'm almost positive. Yeah, that's probably what you're supposed to do for that. Jump off the second one. They probably just go all the way to the brown platform. Little tight, but should be doable. 
Yeah. Okay, that's the way to go there. Oh, damn. Yeah, if you can get that jump... Oh, man. Perfect. Damn it. Okay. Yeah, this doesn't. This does not seem that bad. I think I can definitely do this one. I might jump on top of those question mark blocks potentially, although they are a little high up for it to be, to be worth it. Hmm. Ah! Huh? Oh, that jump's so scary. Fuck. Ah! Okay. Um. Probably supposed to bounce off the Koopas. Hip. Okay. Ah! Oh, damn it. Oh, come on. Yeah, you really have to avoid him. I think probably jumping on the first stand dune, then jump spinning over him is probably the safest route to go. Oh, that was really bad. We lost a lot of time there. Okay. That jump's not that bad once you find the spot. Yeah, small jump and then do that. Okay. Yo, okay, that's kind of the play. Kind of the play. Okay. Kind, well... Yeah, I don't know. That was honestly a lot to, to like try to comprehend at once. I need to do that a couple more times to really get that down. Damn it. That jump is, it's not that hard, but like if you mess up the timing, you really can't recover from it. Hmm. You, you have, you absolutely have to jump on a Koopa there. You can't take the bottom path. You got to jump on a Koopa. Okay, so I got to get used to that. Yeah, that's the safest method. Like, hmm, okay. That is not as easy as it looks. I almost wonder, like, would it be better to, to, like, let the the spike pass? No, I doubt it. There's no way that would be faster. I'm honest, I'm not sure what to do there, to be honest. Yes, okay, come on. F no, I didn't know it was after that. Okay, so I need to jump over that block, I think. Maybe. Yeah, I think I have to do that because the sand dude comes up. I need to get up there without getting caught wasting time. Okay. So I'm probably supposed to jump over the block. Okay. This one is hard. This one I think is kind of up there with like the mini mountaineer. That one I still think is the hardest one that I've done because goddamn, this one is tough. Like if I were slowing down, I could obviously do this pretty easily, but trying to blaze through it without stopping at all makes it like 50 times harder. But it is really fun cuz I am I feel like I'm slowly very slowly getting better at it. Whatever, just keep going. Just keep going. Probably too slow, but that's fine. So, yeah, the second Koopa is really do not hit the second Koopa. I have to hit the third one. First, third, and then honestly, we just blaze at that point. First, third, go forward. I don't think you need to hit the very last one. First, third, okay, and fifth. First, third, fifth, got it. Jump over this. No, there's coins! Shit, I wasn't even paying attention to the coins. I was so happy that I did that so well. I'm like, ooh, fun, let's just beat the level. All right. Just go. Shit. Okay, I'm watching a video. I really don't know what to do at the end. It's not obvious at all. A few moments later. Okay. I see what I am doing wrong here. So basically, I'm supposed to triple jump off of those two platforms at the very end to pass everything clean. Is that good enough? Yeah, no, no! What? How is that not good enough? Oh my god, nine hundredths of a second off? Holy shit, this one's fucking hard. The ending is so hard, you cannot slow down at the end. Ah, that was it, that was it! Oh my god, I did everything perfect! I just, I, I choked, I choked, that's all it was. Okay, I'm getting this now. Yes! 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 Oh, it took 45 minutes, but I did it. Yes! Oh... Oh my god, I did one in 45 minutes. Wow, that was hard. Oh my god, that was so hard. Holy crap. Like, the way you have to triple jump at the end to clear all those blocks and not get hit is, like, stupidly precise. You have to do it in just the right spots to avoid everything and not slow down. Oh my god, that was hard.
I think all that's left now is five star. Yeah, poison swamp scramble, swing into action, stone slide, and screw top it up. All right, that's all we got to do left. Okay, poison swamp. Reach the goal in 80 seconds or less. All right. It was 65 for us, but yeah. Okay, I'm allowed to touch coins again. <laughs> Thank fucking God. Okay, yeah, this should just be a practice run. Let's get a good grasp of the level. This doesn't seem that bad, at least compared to the other level I just did. Oh my God. So maybe jump off of the left side and then up. Okay, that's the solution. All right. Kind of surprised. Here's where it's going to get interesting. Okay, here I'm honestly not sure yet. Um, hmm. Yeah, that, that's an interesting one right there. Yeah. Okay. So now it's the fun part. The part that makes no sense how you're supposed to do fast. Like, what the fuck? Oh my god, okay. Hold on, I was kind of figuring it out. A little bit. I'm just gonna watch the video, dude. I have no fucking idea still. It just felt like luck. A few moments later. Okay, I see what to do. It's gonna be a little tight. A little tricky to get used to, but honestly, it doesn't even seem as bad as the other level I just did. So I did also discover something here. You can literally just run down and boom, look at that. Bam. Uh, but that gets in the way. But that's probably a little bit faster. Especially once I can get the uh, Koopa jump down after that part. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, a little bit of a bigger jump and a little bit later, not so soon. Okay, good. That's not that hard. Now, this part's ridiculous, dude. <laughs> like, I'll be real, this part's kind of ridiculous. So, I have to jump- so basically I have to jump, and then do a double jump on the other side, a very quick triple jump, and that's how you get across. And that's kind of the hardest part of the level. If I can do that, the rest of it's not that bad. Oh, 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 wait a minute, hold! Hold the phone, is that a plan B? I don't know if I can actually clear that little tiny jump without running into the wall. But that could be a potential plan B. If the Koopa jump does not work. F oh, that's actually not the worst plan B. Okay, let's just keep going. I want to practice this anyway. So can I just, I can just jump down here, bam. And then bam. Okay, that works. That works. Okay, that works. Holy sh**. Okay. Okay, honestly, all right, um, I kind of like the plan B more than the Koopa. Well, I don't know, the Koopa is really good, but like, the, that, hmm, that ground underneath is, is not bad, too. Shit. Okay, okay, let's just keep going. Shit. Hmm, okay, that one was better, but still not, we need 65, okay, I mean, this is gonna be a PB, or it's like basically the same. Holy hell, man. Dude, I really- I cannot mess up that part with the disappearing blocks. I don't understand. I don't get it. I'm doing exactly what the video- does he spin? Oh my god, this is so f***ing infuriating. I'm gonna change characters. Why not? Give me strength, Luigi. I, dude, I don't fucking under- if I don't get it next time, I quit. Honestly, like, this level's too fucking hard. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing wrong. I really have no idea. And there's, like, not really another strategy that I can try. There's almost nothing else I can try. Dude, that was fucking perfect, and it still didn't work! That was perfect. That was actually perfect. And it didn't work. It just didn't want to work. Yes! Fuck! Fuck! I did it one time and then I choked! Because I had no idea what I was supposed to do after that! Because I've never gotten that far! I finally did it once! I don't even know what I did differently there! Like, I think what it's coming down to is my spin jump timing. But, like, it's really- it's not obvious what I'm supposed to spin jump. A few moments later. I don't fucking, dude, okay, one more shot. I'm gonna do one more attempt. If I don't get it, fuck this. I don't care anymore. I'm getting so fucking tired of this level. More moments later. Yeah, okay, you know what? I don't give a shit. I've got 68 seconds. Fuck this level. This level's bullshit. 
I'm gonna move on. Swing into action. Reach the goal in 75 seconds or less. Okay. Now I've got my high score was 69 seconds, so this one probably won't be that hard. I'm just gonna have to learn the swinging mechanics. That was bad. Okay. This is the first attempt. We're just doing a test run through here. This already seems a lot easier than what I was doing before. Kind of. Uh, I thought maybe I could make... Why does that... Dude, st I'm pushing down, you f***ing dumb f***ing controller. Uh, yeah, I think I have to land on that platform. I don't think I can go from uh, vine to vine there. Okay, yeah, so I cannot... If I spin jump, I'm gonna lose time there. Just simple as that. No spin jumping there. You just commit to your jump and that's it. Okay. Yeah, that's really not that hard. You just commit to the triple jump, do not spin jump, and you're good. Oh my god. What the f f is this? Hello? What do you want me to do about this? This is f stupid. What the f? I'm looking at a video. I don't give a now. So f***ing annoying. Just jump on the goddamn Goomba. Please. Just do that. Go. Well. It wasn't a gold again. But I think it was a new record. Jesus Christ. That is so precise. I made barely any mistakes. So stone slide tower climb. Let's try this. Reach the goal ring in 90 seconds or less. Oh my god. I'm going to have to watch the video. I can already tell. Yeah, I'm definitely going to I'm going to have to watch it. Well, let's give it a shot to start. Well, this is incredible. I can already tell it's way too slow. How do you do this in 60 seconds? I wasn't even close to the finish line. Holy shit. I got to watch this one too. A few moments later. This one's going to take a lot of practice. Holy shit. I have to, like, wall jump off of this, this block, and then boom, like that. And I go up here. I barely even use, um, I do, like, this. Get up here. Okay. Hmm. How the f***? Okay, wow, you really gotta climb way up. Okay. I'm just gonna kind of try the route that I watched, because, god damn, that was nuts. Holy s***. Okay, we're still learning. We're, I'm learning the route. That's basically what's going on now. I'm just learning this route. This absolutely absurd route. Damn. What the f***? I gotta do that in 60 seconds? 60 seconds? What the f***? Why doesn't that work every time? Why doesn't that f***ing work? It just doesn't want to work. Why? I at least have that down. That's nice. The dry bones, I don't understand at all. How the fuck does anyone do this in 60 seconds? Like, seriously. I'm happy getting 71 seconds. 72 seconds. 60 se I have to do that in 12... 12 seconds faster? How? Oh my god, that's crystal bronze! God, dude, they were not messing around. That is definitely a five-star challenge level compared to the other ones. I think I can mess up the dry bones thing, so it's like if I don't get it, oh well, I lose like two seconds. That's fine. I honestly might not even go for that freaking jump. That jump is just absurd, and it's not consistent for whatever reason. I don't know why, but it's just not. Like, seriously, screw that jump. It's just not worth it. I f***ing hate that thing, but that's the fastest I've gone up so far. Okay. So I see what I how I messed that up. Basically, I'm supposed to wall jump off of the pipe, then the block, and then back. That's what I need to do. I mean, if I could at least get a silver today, I'd be happy with that. Because, god damn, it's so... Just like, the strats for this one is... It's a lot of strats to remember. I'm just getting annoyed. I'm, I'm not having any fun anymore. I'm not having fun. I've been playing for way too long. That's also the problem. I've been playing literally all day. Screw top it up. Let's do the last one. Reach the goal in 90 seconds or less. I doubt I'll do it, but I'll do the best that I can. Okay. 
And I'm just gonna have to try it another day, because I'm just not gonna get it. It's just not gonna happen. There's no f***ing way. How the f***? How do you get up there? How do you get a gold, nonetheless? There has to be cheese strats. There's no way there isn't. Now, to be fair, I did do this part very slow last time. So this is faster. Oh my god, look at all this shit. What the f*** is this? I can't even make it on time. And then basically, like, you don't kill any enemies. Oh, I can do this. Okay, this is pretty easy. That's not that hard to do. You jump up here, you're supposed to f do this shit. Okay, I guess that's not that hard, but... It's like, I have to do, like... Okay, this is actually not that hard. That's pretty easy. That I can do. Oh, then I'm supposed to do... Okay, then I'm supposed to do this. Okay, I mean, honestly, that's not that hard. Like, some of this stuff is not that bad, but some of it is, like, the things they're asking me of? Like, what the hell? Like, I'm supposed to f***ing stay... I, that's what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to do that. Like, how? How do I do that fast? I cleared it. I'm genuinely happy just clearing it. Good lord. All right. Um, I'm going to go ahead and stop for today. I will be probably coming back to do the rest of them. If you guys uh, really like the video, I see it gets a lot of attention. I would absolutely love to try to go for golds for the rest of them. So that'll be the plan. If this video does well, I will do another video on coin collection, one-up rally, special, and then a final one on anything I miss. I recently tried to get gold medals in all of Time Attack for new Super Mario Bros. U challenges. Today, I will be attempting coin collection. For all the stages that I have gotten golden, I'll play them and, you know, whatever. But if I don't have gold, I'm going to be going for gold. So I think I'm supposed to be getting 86 coins here. And that's that. So let's get started. We'll see how hard this is so far. Okay, so far I've definitely made a big mistake. Let's just run through it, see how it is. I mean, this seems pretty straightforward. Ow. No, but this does actually seem pretty straightforward. Okay, let me actually... Oh my god, whoa. I don't even know if it is every coin. I'm assuming it probably is. Oh, that was really bad. Okay, it's actually... It's been a second since I've played this. Gonna have to warm up my gamer thumbs, and uh, once we're good on that, I think we'll be solid. Use triple jumps to collect coins. I'm trying. I'm trying, man. Okay. Okay, let's freaking go. That's what I'm talking about. Hell yeah. All right, that wasn't so bad. Good way to start things off. And yes, I'm going to be playing as Luigi today. I don't know. I just feel like he's going to give me some ungodly good luck. Don't know why. It's just a hunch. Just my prediction on what's going to happen here. Now, Hot Hidden Coin Hunt is our next one. Hit the P-Switch and collect the coins. Oh, I can do that all right. I can definitely do that. Challenge ends when the P-Switch effects end. Oh, okay. I just got to get them fast as hell. Okay. I can do that. Hmm. So I'm thinking the best strategy here is going to be really aiming for those coins in the corners first. And if I can get those quickly, I'm basically good to go. That's probably like the best course of action. Everything else I can just kind of get clean up on the way down. Okay, that was good. Oh yeah, baby. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Just a few tries. Fairly simple one to do. Now, stingy big piranha plants. Reach the goal ring collecting as few coins as possible. Okay, challenge ends if you collect six or more coins. So... For a gold, I got a touch of no coins. Now, this one could be tough. It could potentially be tough, but maybe it won't be that bad. You know, we'll see. And I guess my, the previous score was a bronze. So, okay. So far, so good. So far, so good. You know, honestly, even, like, the time limit is, like, not even that big of a deal. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Okay, I think I see what I need to do there. Because I could, I could probably just jump over it if I'm more careful. Let's see. Yeah, let's just be patient here. Now, I could definitely jump over this one. I don't know if I really... Ooh, yeah, let's just do this. That's a lot safer. Oh, God. Okay, now we're talking. All right. Okay, that wasn't that bad, actually. Oh, is that it? Oh. How did I never do that before? That was actually so easy. Lekitu's Cloud Heist. Commander, Lekitu's Cloud, and use it to collect coins to get 140. I will gladly get that many coins. All right, like it's you idiot. Give me those coins. Oh, yeah. Okay, I don't think this will be that bad. I'm just going to have to get used to like it's you's hitbox. That's going to be our main hurdle here is the hitbox itself. Now, I don't know if another like it's you spot. Oh, okay. Now we're kind of talking. I did not realize it's only one. Okay, that could potentially be really difficult. 
You know what else I could also do is try to get coins before I land on Lekitu's Cloud because I don't think I get punished for that. Okay, I can get a couple, I guess. I don't even know if you can get all these coins. I mean, you probably can if you're really, really careful. All right, come back here. So you definitely... Do, do I have to get... I don't think I need to get all of them, but I do need to get a large majority of the coins. So that's good to know. Oh, no! Oh, I got... Oh, okay, okay. Woo! Oh, my God. I thought that was going to be 139. All right. Okay, that one was good. I'll take it. I got to say, so far, these have been a lot easier than, than last time I did this. And I don't know if that's just because I've gotten a bit more accustomed with the game. I mean, that could definitely be it. But I don't know. These do feel a little bit easier. But let's not get mistaken. It's only going to get harder from here. Let's see what else you've got. Hot Air Yoshi Ride. Collect all the coins in 50 seconds or less. Okay, so I got to do 30 seconds for gold. Okay. This one seems not too bad. Okay. Wow, he moves very awkwardly. <laughs> why does he move like this? Yeah, Big Yoshi, why do you move like this? You move so just like, I don't know how to describe it. I guess kind of slow and janky. Just fall down, get all these. Get that one real quick. Okay, scoop that up. I think a lot of this is really just going to come down to learning how Yoshi works. All right, yeah, so I so that was like 38 seconds. Um, yeah, I think I can do that. I just need to figure out, figure out his momentum a little bit better. Yeah, there we go. 28.88. That's what I'm talking about. So next, Ghost House, Coin Curse, collect as many coins as you can. You need to get 150 challenge ends when there are no coins left. So this one very well might have, or I might have to get all the coins here. I can see that being pretty likely. To, wait, hold on, hold on. There's no coins left. I mean, I guess the best thing I can really do is just try to get more coins? Question mark? Okay, I don't think that was enough still. Man, I need to get a lot of coins fast. Yeah, that's not enough coins. I'm gonna need to get like every single coin, basically. Like, I think I could probably miss a couple, but not more than that. Okay, 128, was that enough? 143, uh, 148, just barely. Dude, I could literally only miss two coins. That's kind of insane. If someone can actually get all those coins, you know what, more props to you, because that's, cr that, that was, that would be really tough to do. Now, Perilous Coin Dodge, I've gotten a silver on this one. Reach the goal ring, collecting as few coins as possible, so I need to get zero coins on this one. Okay, I kind of like, you know, I honestly kind of like doing no coins more. <laughs> it's a lot simpler than going for all the coins. All right. So far, so good. Nothing too crazy here. I guess I'll just duck these. Okay. Easy enough. I, really, I don't know why I feel like yeah, I'm going to need this fella. Uh-huh. Okay, I actually needed them to get across. <laughs> Oh, God. Okay. Oh, that was a little scary. Let's see. Don't hit the boxes. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh. Oh, come on. Okay. Oh, well, look at this. There's a freaking bullet bills that I can use. Okay. Well, let me at least... Okay. So, that is... That's not that bad. Honestly. Oh, God. Coins can spawn at the end, too. <laughs> Great. All right. Let's try that again. That doesn't seem that bad. <laughs> okay. We made it. There we go. That was a really fun one. That was actually really, really fun. Waddle Wing Wipeout. Defeat every Waddle Wing and collect at least 40 coins or 67 coins. Challenge ends if you touch the ground before defeating all Waddle Wings. Okay, I feel like this one's going to be pretty damn hard. I'm not going to lie. This this sounds like it's going to be difficult. <laughs> I have to, I, what do I have to defeat all the Waddle Wings? What's the purpose of doing that? Okay, well, I just missed half of them. Oh, yeah, this one's going to take some tries. I can already tell. You know what? At least there's kind of room for air I, since I can cling onto the walls, right? I can save my jump. I can just kind of get these. Okay, you know what? There's a, this actually might not be that bad. Okay. Okay, am I just going to get all the coins? Oh my god. Dude, I don't think I actually need all the coins. Oh my god! Okay, I definitely got this. This is not that bad. A few moments later. No, I missed a coin! God damn. Like, I basically know what to do, but this is actually really hard. I take back everything I said earlier. This is really precise. It is so much more precise than it looks. Okay, one down. Use the float. Hit this guy. Use the float. 
Hit this guy. Oh, he debated me. He debated me. Oh, that was the run. Oh, man. Okay. All right. One more squish. One more squish, baby. Okay. Now just get the rest. Get the rest. <laughs> yeah. Woo. Oh, my head's dizzy. Oh, what the hell? Oh, my. Dude, I actually got way too excited. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. That was satisfying. Woo, that was a, that was very very difficult. Man, like that one was really fun because I could feel myself getting better and better at the glider the more and more I did it. That was great. How many Okay, so I actually apparently already got a gold on this one, so I'm just going to play it. Prickly Goomba's coinless run. Doesn't really matter how I do, I'm just going to try it out, reach the goal, collecting as few coins as possible, so zero coins. Okay? I mean, if I already got gold on it, then it must have not been that hard before. You know what? I'll do an actual Valiant attempt. If I don't get it, whatever. Okay, this one's not bad. Honestly, this one's not bad at all. Okay, coins here, yada yada. Go ahead and breathe fire. We'll go down. Okay. Uh, what else? Is that it? Oh, no, that's definitely not it. Whoa, okay, Goomba. Come here, buddy. Time to fall. Thank you. Oh! Ha! <laughs> Oh, I got a gold. I got a coin somehow. I don't even know how. Okay, whatever. I cleared it. Like I said, I've already gotten gold on it in the past, but I cleared it. 200 cliff top coins. Collect as many coins as you can. Reach the goal. So we need to get 200 here. Oh my god. I actually remember this one. This one's kind of hard. However, I do have actually not that much time. Oh wow. Okay. This could potentially be difficult. Oh god. This is very scary. <laughs> like, it's actually not that bad, but it is uh, a little scary. I'm not going to lie. Only bronze? Oh my, holy crap, you gotta go fast. How many did I need? Just like 180? Because the fuzzy part I could definitely do faster with some more practice, so 200, 200 coins. Only 200 coins. Real quick, 200. Okay, here's my idea. Jump up here, and then just kind of like fall down, hit all these. Man, that's hard. I'm gonna, you know what, I'm, mm. This is gonna take some time, I think, to really figure out a good route. So I'm wasting time here. Oh, oh, I got it. Oh, wait, no, I need 200. I, thought, I keep thinking it's 180. 200 there. All right, feeling good about this one. This one's been pretty fast. I found a few strategies to make this a little bit faster, which is good. Please be fast enough, though. Oh, my God. Okay, four. Oh, my God, oh, we did it. Oh, by one second. We got it by one second. Wow, that was a really, really tough one. I had to do this crazy strat with the spinies where I kind of like skipped one while getting all the coins. That's basically what saved me. And I had really good, a uh, really good cycle with the fuzzy as well. That was tough, man. That was a tough one. Dark, dark coaster. Click as many coins as you can and reach the goal. Okay. I apparently almost got it last time, 173. So we just got to get 175 here. I'm assuming that's going to be probably all of them. Okay. Coins right off the get-go that I just missed. That's good. All right, there we go. That is... There we go. That's all of them. Okay, now what? One's there. One's there. Grab these. Okay, so far this doesn't seem that bad. Oh, gosh. These freaking bats might throw me off, though. Gotta get all those. Just missed two there. That's fun. You know what? Let's just run through it and see what it's like. Okay. Yeah, so I don't think I'll get it this time, but I honestly do think I'll be able to get it. Um... This one doesn't seem that bad. Oh yeah, let's definitely do that. Lighten this crap up. Oh my, wow. That was not very good. Okay. So 175. I mean, I, I got kind of close there. So 171. Is there like a coin at the end too? Gotta be like one. Yeah, there's one coin at the end, I think. Yeah, 172. Okay. So yeah, that's what I need to do. I think I need to... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Never mind. I'm actually allowed to miss some coins. Thank God I did not want to do that again. I don't know how I didn't get a goal on that before. That really wasn't that hard. Cloud top coin evasion. Reach the goal. Collecting as few coins as possible. So don't touch coins yet again. Apparently the record was two coins. Okay. Well, so far these have probably been the easiest things to do out of like all of them. But you know what? Never say never. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, not going to lie. That, that's a little tough. Um, that doesn't seem... Let me retry that. That doesn't seem that bad. That's a strategy. You know what? That works. 
I will take it, dude. I will frickin' take that, man. Hey, I'll take that, too. Ooh, hello. Hello, plant. Oh, hi, coins. Hi. Go away. Ah! Ah. Okay. Uh, yeah! <laughs> okay, we're fine. We're fine. Uh, still just a little tad bit nervous about this. Ah! <laughs> Woo! Okay, that is not that bad. Okay, I think I think I know what to do there. That that's not that bad, honestly. Ah! <laughs> okay, you know what? You know what? We're just gonna do a little bit of this action. We're gonna do it now. Mm, Luigi, Luigi, come on! The bubble was touching your toe. Oh no. Oh my, I'm so lucky the shell did not get collected there. Okay, whoo! All right, that one was a little bit on the sweaty side, but I'm, I'm very glad that it wasn't too bad. Uh, okay, we just hit four stars. There is only two of those, and then there is two of these. Oh God, oh God. This might be the hardest one, but we'll get to that last. But anyway, moving on, Attack of the Bobbles, only four more to go. Collect all the coins in 100 seconds or less. Oh man, I remember it. So I can do this in 50? I gotta do this in freaking 50? Oh boy. Okay. I'm still trying to really feel out how to really do this one. I'm, I am not sure. Oh, hold on, hold on. Stomp there. You go there. Oh man, that was so close. Well, I was at 45 seconds though. Wow, you really gotta go fast. A few moments later. Wow, that was my best attempt. I wasn't even close to 50 seconds. Holy shit, this one's hard. Okay, come on. Oh no, I missed a jump! Oh, it was so close. Okay, all right. I figured out what I need to do now. I'm definitely gonna get this. That was very close. Yeah, this route is kind of insane. Like, the way that you have to do this, again, it's kind of like doing slashes across the screen. It's basically what you have to do here. Like, you just need to keep as much flow as possible. Come on, open up, thank you. Alright, let's do this. Come on! <sighs> Come on, be good enough! Oh my god! Damn, that was really good, too. Okay, this is it. Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> Holy crap! Wow, that was way harder than I thought it was gonna be. Oh my god! Jesus, 49 seconds. I can't believe I did that. Woo! Wow, we are definitely doing this much faster than last time, though. Because last time, I still had like 10 to go, and I'm sitting at a wrap, almost two hours of recording. But now we only have three left to try. This one, I don't know if I'm gonna get it today. I'll, of course, try, but... Spine Coaster, Coin Cruise. I've gotten silver on this. Collect as many coins as you can and reach the goal. Okay, so another Spine Coaster. I feel like once I kind of learn the pattern, it probably won't be that bad. Just gotta learn the pattern. Yeah, I don't think this one will be that bad. IMO. I'm, actually, I'm really glad I stopped to get the mushroom. That's probably gonna be super important. Yeah, you know, I should definitely try to get all of the coins. All of them. And I'm pretty sure I actually need to get all of them this time. Um, I really need to try to not get hit. I mean, it is kind of nice that we do get actual hit points here, but... I think, especially at the end, it's gonna be super necessary to keep it. Because, yeah, dude, these coins are, um, not necessarily in hard spots, but, like, it's gonna be a lot easier if I'm, uh, Big Luigi. Alright, so I only missed five that time. You know, strangely, I feel like the ending's not even that hard. I think it really... The difficult part's, like, in the middle. Because there's just some really awkward jumps. Like, once you st once we start int introducing stars into the equation... I don't know, the coaster just really starts to get awkward when it comes to jumping. So, yeah, we just, we just have to get them all. That's all there is to it. There is no, oh, I missed one or two. Nope, you get them all, son. You get all of them. <laughs> what?! How do I keep missing those? For some reason, I'm missing, like, those blocks of square coins. That's not hard. Like, that's, how is that even hard for me to do? Oh, I got one spiny, and then I freaking missed the last jump. Oh, my God. Well, now I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to get it now. Two 
hours later. Yeah! <laughs> Hallelujah! 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 <sighs> wow, that one took a long time. So now Castle Coin Bypass, only two more to go. Reach the goal, collecting as few coins as possible, so I need to get zero coins here. Ooh, this seems, this seems like it's gonna be pretty difficult. Huh, I really am not a fan of this already. Oh my god, is that all I'm actually supposed to do? Spin jump on the right side of that platform? Um, again, if I don't get gold on these five-star ones today, I will go back and, and probably do like a final video trying to get gold medals on everything I missed. But... Yeah, if I can at least get this one today, that'd be great. The don't touch anything one, I know that one is stupid hard. I still don't know how I'm going to do that one. Okay, what the hell am I supposed to do here? Can I be mini Mario? Hello? <laughs> what do you want me to do about this? That is dumb. That's actually so dumb. Okay, oh, this this part's not that bad. Okay, okay that's tough. Yep, that's a tough one. Um... Okay, that's not that bad. Okay, that's not that bad. Um, and then just do this. Should be fine, okay. It's honestly just the, be the beginning so far is kind of like the hardest part. Everything else, difficult, but manageable. Okay, okay, we got through the hardest parts. Now, I just have to try to remember what else I'm supposed to do here. Now I'm struggling with that jump. It's the lava jump. All right, this is the one. Okay, this is the one. God damn! How do you do that? I don't know, maybe I need to like somehow, I guess jump at a different time or something? Like, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do there. The coins are so close. It's tight, bro. That is tight. Okay. You know what? I have a plan. We're gonna wait till the red coins disappear. That's what we're gonna do. They will disappear. Okay, they're gone. All right, now we continue as planned. Okay, let's just be patient. We have plenty of time. Plenty of time here. Let's be patient. Okay. Oh my god, we did it! We did it! Oh my god, we did it! <laughs> yeah! Oh yeah! Oh, I knew I was able to do it, but wow, that took quite a while. And it's interesting because there really were only like maybe three or four jumps that were difficult out of the whole thing. But those three and four jumps were so stupidly precise, especially that lava jump. Oh my god. But man, I, I, I guess I figured it out. I don't even know what I did differently. I think I just jumped earlier or something. But now, the last one. Don't touch anything. I honestly do not expect to beat this. This one is insanely difficult. Probably the hardest challenge out of the entire game. So I will go ahead to just try to beat it, just so you can see how absurd the challenge is. If I can beat it, awesome. If not, well, wasn't that expected. Okay, that was really bad. So yeah, I need to get through a good chunk of this before touching any coins. We obviously try to touch zero, but yeah, dude, this one does not play around at all. It really doesn't. What if I wait? Yeah. Okay, just timing the cycle out, that works. Oh god, though. This, though? Ah, <laughs> oh, damn, okay, I'm just gonna keep going, because just so you can see how ridiculous this is. I mean, look at this. Look at this crap, dude. And there's freaking spinies here now? Like, what do you want me to do? I have to, like, avoid those somehow? I don't know how. Oh my god, now there's two like a twos. Oh my god, how did I not get hit there? <laughs> look at this! Action, dude, just look at this, man. Oh my god, there's so much stuff happening. I mean, honestly, if, if there was just a way for me to somehow... Ugh, get access to the Leka 2, that would be awesome. But it's just not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. I touched way too many coins as well. So for me to do this, I basically have to run up to this platform and not like, okay, I basically have to do that. I have to do that, I have to do that. Okay, I somehow did it. I have to do that a couple more times though, during this run. A couple more times. Holy crap, that was close. 
There's an invisible block there. Of course there is. Why wouldn't there be? Screw it. I'm going to keep going. Of course there's an invisible block there. Like, why, why wouldn't there be? This is insane, dude. I can't even clear the level. Oh, my God. You know what's crazy about those jumps is you cannot use a spin jump to correct yourself. I think that's what makes it so especially difficult is you just have to get it. Like, that's what's great about the spin jump in this game is if you mess up your jump a little bit, okay, well, I kind of like, you know, correct myself a little bit. You know, that's what makes it really fun to use. It's very quick. It's nimble. It's useful. It's nice. But with this, you can't do that because the coins are so close to the platforms. And not only are they close, they're constantly moving. Dude, I don't know how you do that. I really don't know how you do that. <sighs> okay, I somehow dodged one of them. Don't know how, but I did it. Oh my god. I, I hate this. I hate this. Holy crap. I was just trying to get my footing. And then Lekatu's like, hi, what a spiny little treat. And I'm like, no. He's like, okay, here you go. Enjoy it. And I didn't enjoy it. I actually just died because they're, they're spiky. Spike's bad. Oh, my God. I will say at the very least, at least I kind of jump into the, the meta level pretty quickly. Like, I get a nice little warm up here. You know, this this part with the green platform is pretty easy. The dark blue ones kind of wait a second. Lekatu comes in. Yada, yada, yada. Usually, sometimes I hit a coin at the end, but usually that's not that hard. So I'm glad that at the very least, I get into the level pretty quickly. It only takes like maybe 15 seconds compared to like a minute where, with some of these where it just takes so long to get to the hard part. <laughs> oh, you can actually do that. Okay, okay, that's interesting. Yeah, that's what you have to do. You have to do that jump without spin jumping. You have to perfectly complete that jump without a spin jump for extra correction. Twice. And it's moving fast as hell. Good freaking luck. Dude, what? That jump is stupid. That jump's actually so stupid. I'm going to give it one more attempt. I'm I'm uh, I'm getting tired. I've been playing for a while. Man, I was so close that time. Like, that was actually a really close attempt. But I think I'm going to go ahead and end for today. So, I, I did better than last time. I mean, we got gold in everything except don't touch anything. I kind of figured I wasn't going to get it. Especially after playing for such a long time doing all that. So, basically, what I, what I still have to complete is... Oh, gosh. I still have to do four for time attack and then one for coin collection. All right. We'll be back next time, though with 1-Up Rally. The new Super Mario Bros. U challenge continues. Today, we are doing 1-Up Rally. Now, the Goombrat Stomp, this one already has a gold. In fact, this is actually a lot shorter than um, the other ones that we've done. So, whoops. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, try out the Goombrat Stop. Jump on the Goombas without touching the ground to earn 1-Ups. Okay, so, it's, like I, so, as I've been doing, I already did this. If I get gold this time, cool. If not, it doesn't really matter. You may have noticed we're also playing as Toad today. Now, why are we playing as Toad? Because we haven't yet. It's basically the only reason why. And that was ridiculously easy. Wow. Maybe today it won't be painful. Next, we've got Stone Eye Koopas jump on enemies without touching the ground to earn one up. So that's going to be basically the theme of today. We're going to get a lot of one ups. And that's about that. What if I go for all the flying one first? I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? Oh, oh, I see what's going on here. I have to let them come back over and over again. Ooh. Okay, this is going to be kind of spicy, actually. So this guy should come back. Yep. All right. You know what? This one's probably not going to be that bad. I'm just going to have to get used to the flow of the game again. I just woke up. Now I'm more awake by about at least 3%. And we're going to get ourselves 30 one-ups. You know, this is one of those ones I feel like you kind of just go for forever. What it seems like, at least. But we just got to get 30. Oh, oh no. Oh no. That seems bad. Oh my god. I did How did I even grab that? This is it. This is the one. 
Yeah, with three seconds to spare, baby. Hell yeah. Woo, that was a satisfying one. So Goomba, Bounce Bash, jump on enemies without touching the ground, of course, as usual. So I got to get 41 ups here. My record is uh, 27. Already at the two stars. We passed one star already. So now they're going to get tough, I guess. This one seems like it's going to be very disorienting. Yeah, this one's going to be very disorienting. I think if you keep up with the Goombas as they're coming down, it's probably not going to get that overwhelming now that I'm kind of realizing that. God. This is, this is still, this is going to be hard. I think this one's going to take a good amount of attempts, but it feels pretty doable. I'm just going to have to be really careful with what time I bounce off of the Goombas. Because if I bounce when it's like too low to the ground, I actually lose a lot of height and it makes it a lot harder to hit. Because like, as you can see, I'm not getting enough height if I hit the Goomba too low to the ground. Even with the jump boost afterwards, it still makes it hard. Okay, I think I found a strategy. Just kind of hang out in the middle. This is the strat, I think. Is it perfect? I don't know. But you know what? It's working pretty well right now. Oh, crap. Oh, no! We can still go! Oh, God. Oh, God, this is scary. Oh, God. But we're still going. All right. Come on, Goombas. I need more of you. More! Give me more! Oh, my God. Holy crap, how are we still going? Oh, okay, I was 28. All right. That's actually kind of a relief. The fact that I can get it and I can still go means that, hey, hey, you know, if I get, like, somewhat far... I get to like the 30s or something, I get hit, I can probably still finish it up. Oh! One more! Yeah! Mm -mm -mm. <sighs> that was a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be. Oh my god. Oh man, I was like, I was really on my tiptoes for a second there. 41 though! Hey, we even topped the 40. That's great. Extra credit. Give me some extra credit, Toad. Penguin bowling. Oh boy, what does that entail? Slide across the ice without stopping. You defeat enemies during one-ups. Oh, hell yeah. This is going to be sick. My high score is 31, apparently. Like, wow, I almost got it. So, yeah, this will this should totally be doable. Oh! Yeah, this is just trial and error. I love trial and error stuff. Really makes you feel like you're learning and getting better and better. So, I'm all for it. I also find it very interesting how the silver medal is 30 and the gold is 32. Really curious how this is going to end. I think that's where it's going to get tough, is the very end. Ooh, see that? Okay, I think for that particular Koopa, I need to jump really, really late, and that's how I get up top. <gasps> ooh, uh, ooh, uh. Yeah, jump late. I think jumping late is going to be the key for that. I just got to find just the right spot to hit him. Okay. Okay, let's just keep going for now, just so I can get an idea of what's coming up. So I've missed two so far. Okay, yeah, you know what? That's not going to be that hard. I think I can definitely do this. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, that wasn't so bad. And we've got three dry bones. Jump on the enemies without touching the ground as usual. 31 ups here. Oh. Okay, this one might actually be a little bit hard. Oh, yeah. This one could actually be... Well, actually, you know what? No. Okay, the, the difficulty here is going to be the timer. Since I can just infinitely wall jump, that's not a problem. It's definitely going to be all about the timer. I think a lot of this one in particular really comes down to just being super aware of, like, where you are. Which I know sounds obvious, but, like, a lot of times you know, when you're playing a game like this, you're just kind of running on autopilot. You really cannot do that for this challenge. You have to be aware of which direction you're facing when you need to wall jump. Because wall jumping is 100% uh, critical to making this possible. Otherwise, you know, obviously I'm going to hit the ground like that and get two up, which is not anywhere close to what I need. One more. One more. Come on. Come to Papa. Yes! Yes! Yeah! Yeah! Next, we've got Bullet Bill one-up bounce. We've got to get 60 one-ups on this one. Oh, my God. 60, dude. That's insane. Oh, my God. Okay. Wow. The, um... The bullet bills do not like to come out of their pipes. I have to actually also learn where they're going to come after I knock out a segment of them. So I know there's going to be a guy on this side I can hit. Oh, if it's the same thing every time. Okay, you know what? I could actually do this. It's, if it's really the same pattern. Oh, hell yeah, I can do this. Okay. I'm just going to have to get used to the pattern. That's it. Okay, this is actually not going to be that hard then. Dude, I'm just going to keep going. Screw it. 
Why not? How high can we get? Can we get to 100? Uh, probably not with the amount of time I have, but screw it. Let's just keep going. How high can we get the score? 72. I will take a 72. Looks like that's actually the highest you can get, because I think I got every single bullet hill. Wow. All right, so what's next? We have star connection. Okay, ooh, how many are even left? There's only four? I have a feeling these are going to be tough, but let's try star connection. Okay, topple enemies with consecutive superstars. Oh, interesting. Okay, so we're using stars for this. And we need to get 77 one-ups. That's a very specific amount. Okay. That's actually kind of cool. You know, I like that they're changing it up a little bit. It's not just jumping over and over again. Now it's stars. I actually really like that. I think that's really cool. Ah, oh, okay. Okay, I think I can definitely get a rhythm for this one. Like, yeah, it's a four star, but you know what? I feel like this one isn't going to be that bad. A little bit of that. Now I have more time for all this stuff. Okay. Oh, I missed one. But, okay, that's fine. Let's just figure out a good pattern. Now we're cooking, baby. Is this the one? Oh, baby, it might be the one. Oh, I missed one. No. Oh, no. Okay, but we figured out the strategy. We figured out the strategy. I don't even want the... I don't even want the silver. Give me the f***ing gold. Okay, we figured out the strat. This is not that... Honestly, this is not that bad. You can absolutely do this one. Okay. Here we go. Good run here. Yes! Yes! Get the... Get the thing! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, man. Dude, I was so nervous because, like, I had never actually gotten all of them ever. Because, <laughs> like, I tried it once. Didn't work. That was the second attempt, and I was worried because I was, like, slowing down, and it still counted, and we got the score. Yes. Now we've got big Goomba Bounce Bash. we got to get 18 one-ups here. Oh. Okay. This one might actually be kind of hard. TBH. This one looks a lot more complex. Do I get the suit? No suit, dude. Don't get the suit. Oh, God. Well, I'll say this. I definitely need to bounce on everything. Like, that's just without a doubt. I need to do that. Wow. Okay. So, this one is very clearly going to really rely on Goomba manipulation here. I got to get one of those Goombas all the way to the right. And I don't know how to do that yet. I mean, how many one-ups even is it? Is it just 18? It's, it's just 18. So, if I can do that, I can probably do the rest of it. So I just have to figure that out, basically. Let me just try, like, a bunch of huge jumps. Like, only huge jumps. See if that's the strategy. Oh, God. Okay. Well, I messed that up. What if I wait a second? I'm going to wait to start jumping on purpose. There we go. Okay. Now let's do this section. So this guy's already moving to the right, which is good. Okay, I think this is the strategy here. Now we've got some Goombas all the way to the right is really like exactly what we needed what okay you know what you know what we actually probably need to do is as soon as we can get our hands on a koopa hit the koopa go back to the goombas and then the koopa is going to stay in its spot hit it again and then finish that might actually be the strategy or i need to get a koopa as soon as humanly possible okay i have time to hit the koopa oh i only have two okay so i Holy shit, dude. I see what I have to do. This is insane. This is actually insane. Oh my god. Okay, so I see exactly what I have to do. I basically just have to bounce on the Koopas four times, no matter what happens. That's what I have to do. So let me actually try to just get to the Koopas as soon as humanly possible. Okay. Then do these, since I only have to do Koopas two more times and that's it. So I basically have to end with the Koopas. Oh, this is actually lined up pretty well. Oh! <laughs> Look at that! I can't believe I did that in like three minutes. Wow. That was a really creative one. I mean, we this has been like pretty much all of the challenges today. Just bounce off enemies a thousand times. Definitely one of the more creative ones. Forcing you to, to do multiple different enemies. That one was fun. So I think there's only two left, which is insane. Dude, I am flying through this today. Now, obviously, we have two five stars left. These ones will probably be ex extremely difficult. Airship, one-up rally. Jump on enemies. Okay, uh, 20 up here. We do get the uh, acorn suit. Okay, depending on if um, the cannonballs are random or not is really going to determine the challenge, I think. Oh. 
Oh, the stage moves. Okay. You know what? This is a lot more different than I honestly thought it was going to be. Oh my god, what the hell? How am I supposed to make that on time? Wow, that is hard. I think I just need to get cannonballs, like, in succession really, really quickly. Like, that is, like, the only option. You know what else makes this hard? I can't see what I'm doing half the time. Just gonna keep going, just to kind of get used to this. Like, do I have to get 20 at the very beginning? I mean, maybe I could do that, but that just seems insanely difficult. Okay, I kind of figured out the strategy here. At this end, at this ending, I have to basically just bounce off of um, the four sequence of balls over and over again. Okay, this is the idea. I did mess it up a little bit, but this is the idea. Dude, I got 14 there. Oh, man, it was so close. 17 that time. Wow, this one is so specific. Like, there is a very, very specific way to get this one. Get it? Oh, my God. Ah! <laughs> that actually worked! Okay, I can't believe that worked because I was a little bit behind on that last cannonball at the top, so I'm like, F it. Let's just ground pound and actually hit them all. Yeah! All right, one more. Can we actually get gold in this entire segment today? I don't know. Maybe. Oh, man. That was like... Oh, that one was so, so good to get. Okay, Paratroopa Panic. Oh, boy. I don't like the title of this. Jump on the Paratroopas without touching the ground to earn one-ups. Oh, I don't have a, a paraglider. Oh. Hmm. Okay, so the record's five. We'll see how this one goes. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm supposed to do eight? <laughs> what? You want me to do eight? How? Okay. I really am not sure. Um, well, that that's probably not going to work either. Wow, this one's going to be hard. I don't know why, though. I feel like I'm going to get it, and I, I really don't have a good reason for it. It just... Seems like, yeah, I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to somehow do it. What if I save one of the uh, paratroopas? That might actually be the solution we're looking for, if I save one of them. So let's save, like, this one here. We'll go back and get it later. So let's get it, like, now. Maybe that'll actually... I think that'll actually make a difference. Want to know why? Because I just delayed that sh Oh, it almost worked. It almost worked. Okay. Maybe I need to do, like, two. So let's leave two out in the open. Here we go. Boom. Oh, okay. Okay, are we actually going to pop off here? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, it was so close. It was so close. I, the issue, honestly, was going for the wall jump on the right. If I just went left... Maybe went for a wall jump on the left. I probably would have been fine. Okay, but I think I have figured this out. Oh my god. Oh! What? Ah, that was the one! Oh my god, this is so difficult. Hit it! Oh my god! Yeah! <laughs> yes! Yeah! Oh! Oh! Oh my god. Oh. We did it. We actually got all gold medals. Oh man, dude. And that that was so Oh. That oh my god. I I can't believe I actually did it. I actually got all gold medals in one of these segments, which is awesome. Which means for the final one of these videos, I won't have to play any one-up rally. Look at this, man. Look at this. Look at all these beautiful golds. Oh, that feels good. That feels amazing to get. But don't worry, next time we'll be back with special. We have finally made it to the final segment. And as you can see, a lot of these are already golden. So a lot of this, I'm just going to be playing them. So there's really not going to be uh, much to gold here. I do think this one, I don't know if I'm going to get it today. I know Cashless Castle Crawl is ridiculously difficult. 
So we'll get to that one at the very end. But of course, let's go ahead and start with Fire Bro. Hmm. How? Wait, okay, how do you actually... Oh, I think I see. If you build up just a little bit of speed, you can probably do like this. Hmm. Or, I have an idea. Okay, I have an idea. Can I actually wall jump off this wall? Now I just want to see if I can actually kill the fire bros. Oh my god, you can't actually... Okay, I could probably actually kill them, but you know what? Let's just do this for real and actually just survive. Okay. Let's at least get one medal. It doesn't really matter. Any medal's fine. Well, cool. Got a gold. Pretty easy one. A really cool one. God, I really want to kill the fire bro if possible. Well, who cares? Doesn't matter. We got it. Now, graceful glide. Earn one-ups and reach the goal without touching the ground in flying squirrel form. Okay. So, we've already kind of done missions like this before. Um, again, you know, I don't have to get a gold, but I'll try to I'll try to get it. It might not be that bad. Oh, you know what? It probably won't be that bad. So, yeah, definitely need to, like, come down here. Bam. Hit this guy. Now we're good. Okay. And that's it. Now the rest of it should be pretty easy. Wow, okay, well. Wow, that that sure should not have taken that long, but we did it. Even though I technically did not have to get gold. All right, mole to goal. Let Monty Mole onto the lift and get him into the goal. Okay, simple enough. Gotta keep our man alive. And I guess that's it. We're just keeping him alive. Nailed it. Okay. That was pretty easy. And we made it. I guess that's it. Right? Now, Marathon Glide. Use the Flying Squirrel powers to reach the goal without touching solid ground. This doesn't seem that bad either. <clears throat> okay. This is another one of those trial and error ones. I've died a few times at this point. And I've noticed a lot of this requires the extra jump. Like, you definitely need to get the extra jump for a lot of these. Like, it makes a pretty big difference. And bouncing off these Goombas gives a little bit of an extra height here. I mean, not that it matters that much. Like, this extra height, or this extra jump is, like, way more important than I thought it was going to be. Like, for pretty much all these, I got to use it. Even for, like, this one, I should be using it. Okay. So this is new record... Okay, that was really bad. No, the freaking Ba killed me. Okay, honestly, that's not that bad. I, I can definitely do that. Oh, God. Oh, God, that was close. Oh, my God. Okay, this actually gets a little scary. Oh, make it. Make it. Ah! Okay, we made it. We made it. We made it. Oh, my God. Okay, you know what? Let him bounce. Let him bounce. Let him move. Yes. Holy, this is actually <laughs> really... Uh, a lot scarier than I thought it was going to be. Ooh, make it, baby! Okay, we're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost there. Okay. All right, I think we got it. We're, like, at the end. We're very, very close to the end now. Okay. Should we go just make sure we bounce off all these guys? Yeah, we're good. We're good. Okay. We're at the end. All right, let's get the star coin for fun. Look at that. Wow. For a two-star, that one was getting me a little sweaty. Not going to lie. Now we've got Bubble Up. Use Baby Yoshi's Bubbles to reach the goal ring. I remember struggling with this one a long time ago, but I think I know what to do with this one. I'm trying to remember what the strategy was, though. It's just been so long since I have done this one. Okay, well, that did not work. You know what is nice? I don't, like, just game over when I hit the ground. I just have to get up. That is really nice that it does that. Okay, there we go. Okay, okay, there we go. We made it. Not bad. Non-stop flight. Use the flying squirrel powers. Reach the goal without touching the ground. Okay, so it's another one of these. Flying squirrel action. Honestly, this one doesn't seem that bad either. I mean, it is a harder level or it's a harder star rank. But honestly, a lot of this is just going to come down to timing and using these boulders correctly. And you guys know I'm a big fan of boulders. Look, I'm all about timing boulders well. Okay, this is basically what I was made for. It's what I was built for. Now, crabs, on the other hand, are a different story, but you will never see me mess up a boulder jump. I have mastered the art of boulder jumping. Okay. 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 Okay, there we go. All right. Oh, my God. Oh, shit. 
No, no, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Oh, but that's the end. Okay. So I, I see what I need to do there. Wow, that's still really difficult. Beak glide, don't get hit. Please don't get hit, pretty please. We freaking got it, baby. Hmm, yeah. Yes. Finally, we've got to our first one where we actually have to get a gold. Be gentle to giants. Reach the goal without damaging enemies. Okay, so basically the complete opposite of what we just did. Like three, three challenges ago. Okay. So no damage, don't touch an enemy. Okay, we'll see how that goes. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. You know what? This is, um... You know what? You know what we're gonna do? <laughs> I think we're just gonna wait. I'm really, yeah, I'm really scared to jump over them. We're just gonna wait. Oh, okay, we made it. That worked, I guess. Cool. At least I can grab coins. Thank God. I'm gonna have to avoid coins, too. Okay, you're gonna go down the hill first, because I'm absolutely not gonna mess with that. Okay, here we go. Gonna wait for you as well. I mean, I might as well. There's like 200 seconds on the clock. Why would I not just wait? All right, goodbye, enemy. All right, we're almost at the end. We're actually getting very, very close. Okay, this jump's pretty easy. This jump is not gonna be as easy. Actually, you know what? With the pipe, it'll be pretty easy. I take that back. Okay, cool. Now, this is, this could be a potential dilemma here. I see what's going on here. Okay. So the answer is, um, this is not looking good. Oof, okay. Can we make this? Let's see. Woo, look at that. Oh man, that is a spicy jump right there. Oh my God. The spicy boy right there. Okay, let's wait a second on these boys. All right, you guys are done. Clear this, I'm gonna wait for you to fall. Okay. Man, this is a long level. Oh, but we're almost done. We're almost done. But is that it? Did we just do it? We just did it. On the first attempt. Now that's what I'm freaking talking about. Hell yeah. I don't know how that wasn't done before. That was not that hard. Like the hardest part was really just the beginning and getting used to jumping over the characters. And now back to the golds. Big air at sundown. Reach the goal in mini form without using the snake blocks. Okay. So no snake blocks. Bounce off this fella. I, I honestly thought I could run underneath them. That's why I tried it. All right, yeah. I mean, why not just do this? And then just jump across. <laughs> like, that is immensely easier. Okay, and then this, I can definitely reach him. I just need to time it out correctly. Then we'll be good. Yeah, if I just do this, yeah, we're good. Like, that's not, that's not hard at all. That's actually really, really easy. Okay, was that it? There's no way. Maybe that was just, like, the first section. Maybe that was it. I don't know. Okay, yeah, it was just the first section. I kind of figured. All right, yeah, so the first section, really, really simple. Oh, this is not going to be as simple. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, there's not going to be a checkpoint either. Oh, okay, so I can just completely bypass the fire, bro. That's really nice. Okay. All right. Are we getting close to the end already? Maybe. Okay, bounce off you. Oh, that might be it. Oh man, that might be it potentially. Or maybe there's another section. Oh my God, it's not over yet. Or is it? I can't tell. Oh, that's it. Okay, we did it. <laughs> we actually did it. These special ones really have not been that difficult. Like I've struggled on a couple of them, but like in comparison to all the other ones we've done previously, these have been way, way easier. So now we've got Balancing Act. This is a, a bronze. So jump on the Wobble Rock to keep your balance for 15 seconds or longer. Oh, boy. Okay, this one might actually be really hard. Or maybe not. What if I just do this? Nope. That did not work. Okay, guys. I think we found the first hard one today. Balancing Act? Hmm. Oh, yeah. This, this one seems like it's going to be actually pretty tough. Because the, the, we have to do a whole minute of this to get a gold. This one could actually... Oof. Ugh, boy. Like, I don't even know why that happened. Like, I don't know why that happened. But at the very least, I can retry really easily. Which is nice. So it's like, yeah, if I know I missed it, then I'm fine. So I think I figured out the strategy for this one. Honestly, a big part of it is just making sure you jump immediately. 
So even if it's tilted, you have to jump immediately, go on the correct side. So it didn't work that time. It's still going to be really hard, but that's the strat. Because if you stand on it for too long, it's just going to topple over, like, immediately. Woo! Oh my god, that took so much focus. <laughs> I had to go ultra focus mode on that. Oh man. So Bowser's airship sneak, again, already done this one. Uh, reach the goal without hurting any enemies, touching any cannonballs, or collecting any coins. Don't touch anything. Okay. Mario is afraid of touching stuff, I guess. So if I can just clear it, cool. This will be an interesting one to avoid. Okay. It actually was not as hard as I thought it was going to be. So let's build a little bit of speed here. Not a lot, just a little bit. Okay. That's all we needed, just a touch of speed there. Um, I cannot hit this guy, but that jump's not hard. Oh, crap. I just messed that up. All right, well. Okay, so now I know that I need to actually do a pretty big jump to clear this. Okay. So I'll do a really, really big jump to clear all of that as well. All right. Okay, I think I'm ready to do this. Okay, we're good. We're good. We cleared it. We cleared it. Okay, perfect. Now what? I don't know what comes after this. Okay, more coins. That's fine. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, gotta be honest. Really not sure what to do about this part. I think just this? Ah! That was a little scary. Hey, we did it! We got it! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about! So now we've got Larry's Groundless Battle. Defeat Larry Koopa without touching the ground. Oh, I think I can do that. Honestly, probably won't be that difficult. I like how a lot of these special challenges boils down to just beating it and that's it. Kind of amusing. Oh. Uh oh, that's not good. Oh, oh my god. Larry, 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 Larry. Now that I've died on this a few times, I think this is another one of those just trial and error kind of bosses. Patterns are pretty much the same. For the most part, like he's going to spawn in the middle here. So there we go. Get a wall jump in, and then we're safe. Okay. Yeah, a lot of this is just going to be patterns. And just learning, like, where the water spouts are going to come in. Now I just got to kill him. I... That was so stupid. I only had one more hit to go. But I know what to do now. Jump on up here. Come to Papa, baby. Hell yeah. Yeah, that wasn't so bad. Again, I'm surprised this is a three-star rank. Like, that could have easily been a one-star. No climbing allowed. Reach the goal ring in mini form. All right. I guess that's it. We're just finishing the level. Okay. Seems simple enough. Oh, interesting. I can't actually... Oh, I can't actually... Okay. I see what they mean by no climbing allowed. Literally cannot climb the walls. Okay. That's actually fun. That's cool. I like that. I'm gonna wait a second. Okay, yeah. That's what I was waiting for. Ah! Holy shit, that was close. Okay, here goes nothing. Woo! Oh boy! Okay, okay. Ah! Uh, no, 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 no. Ah, oh, okay. Okay, just gotta wait this out. And now. Yes. Ah! Wow, that is. Okay, that's actually really hard. What the f? Alright, I take it back. This level is harder than I thought it was gonna be. Now, this feels like a three star level. Okay, finally, finally got it. Okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's got our get get ourselves up. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was too close. Holy crap. We got it. Yes. Ah. Ah. No. 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 Okay. Woo. All right. Wow. That just that one jump was so awkward to get around. Now we've got the trial of Bullet Bill Hill. Okay. I just have to get the star coin. Oh no. I remember this one. This one has such a specific way of getting it. Okay, so we got up. Now what? Now what in the hell am I supposed to do to get up here? Oh, damn! Okay, I think that's the strike. I need to bounce off of that middle bullet bill, hit the right, and then we're golden. I think that's the strat we need. There we go. Okay, planned out the jump a little bit better, and bam! We got the star coin. That's what I'm talking about. So now we've got spin jump, get dizzy. Finally, we have another one that's not a gold. Stop on enemies using only spin jumps without touching the ground. Earn uh, a bunch of one-ups. Okay. Only spin jumps. Okay, I think just with a little bit of trial and error, I'll probably be able to figure this one out too. This one does not seem too shabby. Or oh, just get a double like that. Okay. Oh, yeah, baby. Okay. Uh-huh. Yeah. All right. I'll take a silver for now. 
Yes. Okay, okay, here we go, here we go. I'll hit the rock, hit the rock, yes. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh! Ah, I missed it by one! No, ah! A few moments later. Okay, okay! Yeah! Let's go, baby! Ha-ha! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Multi goal returns. It's another Monty Mole one. Get him to the goal. Okay, let's give it a shot. This is our first four star as well. So this one could actually be perfect. This one could actually get kind of hard. And the main reason for that is because of this cloud of uh, poison smoke behind us. So yeah, that could actually be a bit of a problem. Dude, I'm so glad the fireballs don't kill him. Thank God. Okay, my man's still living. That's a lot of fireballs right there. That is a good amount of fireballs right there, isn't it? Come on, little Goombas. Little Goombas. Come down. Thank you. Ah! You idiot! I hate Monty Mole, dude. A few moments later. So, I have been attempting this level for a very, very long time. I've already gotten gold, so screw it. I'm just going to show you the replay of when it was done last. Oh, I've been recording a lot today. I'm actually recording multiple videos in one day, so I'm, I'm honestly just getting really, really tired. Um, so anything that I've already gotten golden, I'm just going to show the replay. That's all I was struggling with, guys. It's that one jump. There it is. That is the only thing that was challenging. And look at that. There's the end. There we go. So next is Wobble and Rock. How many are left? One, two, three, four, five, six. Jesus Christ, there's so many still. Let's try Wobble and Rock. Uh, stay on the Wobble Rock. Oh, okay, this is just more wobbling. Okay. All right, I think I can do this. I mean, I, I did 60 seconds before. So, yeah, I feel like I can do this again. Oh, but I can't jump. Oh, no. Okay, I take it back. This is going to be much, much harder. <laughs> oh, my God. How am I going to do this without jumping? I got to be real, guys. I think I'm going to have to save this one for the final video because holy sh**, that is hard. How is that only a four star? That is absolutely ridiculous. Good lord. Okay, let's try Seriously Fire Bro. Apparently I've only gotten bronze on this one as well. Okay. Oh, yeah, this definitely looks harder. All right, let's give this one a shot. I mean, I like doing stuff like this. I think these challenges are really cool. Yeah, this one really is about just using your peripheral and then just having good timing. That's all this one is about. All right, I'm going to try one more time. I want to get one more good attempt, but honestly, I might also save this one for um god damn i might have to save this one for the last video as well because this one is actually a lot harder than i thought it was going to be we're on a good run right now okay we've got a good attempt here let's do this thing okay 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 soft ground pound let's go let's go yep okay okay don't look at the timer just play the game yeah! Woo! Let's go! Finish off! We're gonna finish off the time! Okay, that's close enough. 47. Yes! Yeah! Oh, that was, like, legit to be my last attempt, too. So, like I said, I've been recording a really long time today. So, I'm just gonna do replays of basically the rest of these. So, elevator out of service. Reach the goal ring without using the lift. I'm really curious how this one works, because I don't really... Oh, I just used the P-Wing. Oh, this looks cool. You know what? Screw it. I, I can do this. I'll, I'll attempt it, at least. Going up, baby. Keep going up. Come on. Oh, yeah. Let's go. All right. I had a feeling I'd be able to do that one. Now, Castle Crawl. Reach the goal without dashing. This one I do not want to do. I'm just going to do a replay. I know how hard this one is. So let's go ahead and see how I did it years ago. Like, just look at this. This is ridiculous. So 
So the end is pretty easy, but most of that is ridiculously hard. So then the only other one is Express Elevator Reach the Goal Ring in Ice Form without letting enemies or coins touch the lift. I basically just did this level. I don't feel like doing it again because it's even harder. So let's just go ahead and check it out. And it's a lot of just avoiding bob -ohms, freezing them, punching them. That's how you get through this. It's extremely difficult. And I am glad I did it in the past. Even like this part at the end is ridiculous. Like there was like a, there was like what, two or three bob -ohms and three coins all at once. It's absurd. And then that's how the level goes. But we're not done yet. Uh, no more watching my replays. Now I'm going to try one more level. Cashless Castle Crawl. We saw Castle Crawl, but what's the difference here? I can't dash and I can't touch a single coin. Absolute nonsense. This level is going to be awful. Uh, I honestly do not think I'm going to get it today. I'm probably going to have to try this for, again, the last video. Because this one is absolutely... I already touched a coin. Already touched a coin by accident. But yeah, I'm going to give it some attempts, of course. See how, see how well we can do here. Okay, run across. See, it's like parts like this. Like, what do you even want me to do here? I mean, good freaking lord, this is just unfair. Look at this. Look at that, man. That is ridiculous. Like, I think what I'm supposed to do is... Let me come back here. I think I'm supposed to do a crouch jump. Somehow. I somehow do a crouch jump to get across this. I did it! I did it! I don't know how I did it, but I did it. I actually have no idea how I did that. Ah! Oh! Go, go, go! Go, 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 go! How the hell did I do that? Oh my god! Hey, also, I think I know what to do with this part, surprisingly. Ha ha ha! Ah! Oh, f oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, go, go! Ah! Hey, ha ha! Okay. Dude, am I gonna do this? Am I gonna do this right now? Maybe. Now, this this is this is a jump. This is gonna be a jump, man. Look at this jump, dude. Okay, here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. Okay. What the f***, bro? <laughs> what are you supposed to do about that jump? Okay, I think that's gonna be a stopping point for today. But here's the thing. Let's look at how many bronze we have left throughout all of this. Because the final video, or this series, is gonna be completing all of our missing golds. So we have one, two, three, four. Wow, that... Didn't do very good there. We're at four, five, six, seven. We're going to just try to complete these seven last medals in the final video. So stay tuned. Oh, man, I don't even know. You know, let's just go ahead and start with, with Poison Swamp Scramble. But this is going to be tough, guys. These levels are brutally hard. But, like, all I have to do is seven more, and that's it. I just have to do seven more, and then we're finished. See, the, the part that's so difficult for me is this section right here. Because you have to, like, go... You have to go so, so fast. And it's like, yeah, you know, I could do this slower, but to get a gold medal, I need 65 seconds or less. It's freaking crazy. It's actually just so crazy. But thankfully, this part is pretty simple. I hate... <laughs> I say, I say that as I freaking die, of course. So what I think I'll probably do as well is I don't think I'm going to grind out the level for like an hour. I'll probably try it, you know, for like 10, 15 minutes, see if I get it. If not, I'll move on to the next one. There we go. Oh, yeah, that was clean. Okay, that was clean. All right. We're looking good now. We're hitting the gritty. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Gah. How do you do that? How do you do that? Can I slow down? Yeah, I... That's the thing. I don't think I can slow down during this part. Oh, that was... Okay, that was really, really close. Okay, I'm getting this down a little bit. Let me just continue this level so I can see, like, what's coming up. I mean, I'm only going to get a silver or bronze, but that's okay. Because, like, the rest of this isn't that bad. It's really just that one section in the middle that's hard. Like, this is super easy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Mm. No. 
<laughs> Guys, that was so close. Look! Look at this! No! That one mistake! Yes, yes. Big jump. Keep going! Okay. Okay, I slowed down a teeny tiny bit. Let's see if it's good enough. Come on. Oh, this is slightly faster. Come on, come on. Please, 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 please. Yes! 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 64.7! 64.70! Yes! Okay, what do we have next? Um, swing into action, stone slide. See, this is what I'm worried about. Screw top it up. No, it's not this one. It is, it's this one. Stone slide tower climb. You have to do crazy, crazy tech to get 60 seconds. I honestly don't know if I'll get that today. But let's start with this one. Reach the goal in 75 seconds or less. So I got 68 seconds. This honestly doesn't seem that bad. Only a few seconds better. <sighs> okay. Boulder Gamers, let's do this. Swing into action. All right. So I don't remember this at all. It's been a second since I've played this. Oh God, I gotta do the one where you're on these things and you aren't allowed to jump and you have to stay on them for like 30 seconds. That's another one I did not complete uh, in a previous video. So that'll be fun. Can't wait for that. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh, okay. I remember I think the end was really hard. Yeah, because you need to take the Koopa. I rem okay, I remember having to do this. Then I guess you throw him here? Oh, then there's that. Okay, big jump there. So I need to actually... You know what I need to do? When I get the Koopa, I need to jump over those two moving platforms and then throw them at the last one? Because I think the last one is when the piranha plants actually, like, you know, will shoot, will, like, you know, shoot up in the air. So, at some point, I think at this run, I'm just going to do a fun run and just figure out the course. Not go for a gold. Just kind of try to play it. Okay. Take our Koopa. Jump over these guys. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my God. This is... So How do you do this fast? And then spin here. Okay. <laughs> we got another 69. Let's go. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, a little bit slow, but that's fine. That's fine. Okay, I did not mean to spin. No! Oh my god. Okay, I think I'm going to look up a video, fellas. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Mm. Oh my god, no! Ugh, I think that might have been a PB, but it wasn't good enough. Oh, oh no! Crap, crap, I meant to hit the ground on top. Okay, that's fine, let's just keep going. Okay, so, hit this. Two small jumps, but not not too small. Uh-huh, 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 no! It's not gonna be good enough! Oh my god, that was another PB though! 66.4, that is so difficult! There we go, that was good, that was really good. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, oh my god, is this it? Is this it? Come again, come again. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, let's go! Woo! Yes! But now there's, there's, there's this. I'm, I'm scared of this. Stone slide tower climb? Oh, <laughs> I hate this one. I think I might try it last. I'm not even gonna lie. This one is so hard. Fellas, I'm gonna be real with you. I don't want to do that one right now. That one is just so damn hard. This one? Look at that. My best time's 85 seconds. I, don't, I think I need to do something that's not going to completely kill me. <laughs> uh, no, this one didn't look that bad, though. Cashless Castle Crawl. I actually think I could do this one. Because I think when I was uh, playing it, like, a week ago, or however long the video went out, I think I almost did it. But, like, that final jump. It was like a final donut jump that was really hard. That was the problem. You know what? Let's go for this one. Because I feel like this one I can do. And I know I only have a bronze, but, like, it just feels likely. So basically what we got to do is reach the goal ring without dashing or collecting coins. A task only a masochist would complete. Uh, all right. You know what? At least we don't have a strict time limit. We got as much time as we want. Thank God. I can use spin jumps. Spin jumps aren't really harmful. Okay. So this is another one where I'm going to need to like relearn the cycles and stuff. It's, you know, you got to play it a few times to really get it. Oh God. Okay. We're fine. Oh, it's this. That's right. It's that jump. That jump is hard. I have to get that because that's a um, that's a crouch jump, and that is a very precise crouch jump. 
You know, I'm actually thinking about switching to Joy-Cons just because the uh, the buttons are going to be more accurate <laughs> compared to, like, my joystick. I need such precise movement for this. Oh my god! This is ridiculous! Oh, you know what? Let's just keep going. Let's learn the course. Gotta learn the course. But yeah, that will probably be the hardest part, is that one jump. Because I remember everything else, there is other hard moments, but, like, nothing competes with that. That's what you gotta do. That jump. Oh, come on! I do the world's hardest jump, die to a freaking spiny Koopa. That was, that, uh, that skill issue. That was a skill issue right there. I'm getting surprisingly consistent with that. I did not think I would get that good at this jump. Okay. So yeah, it really is just, I need to wait a little bit longer. Right about now. Okay. Yep, that's it. That's it right there. That's the timing. Okay. All right, let's do this thing. That's it. Oh God. There's a spiky man right there. I don't like that. Go away. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay, run, 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 run. Yes. Yeah. All right, I'm, I'm sorry. I just, I've been stuck there for like 20 minutes. Finally got it once. Okay, okay. Oh no. No, 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 no. I don't want to do this. Look at this jump. I'm running. Oh my God, look at the jump. I'm gonna pray to my boulders for a second. Just hold on. We're ready to go. Oh yeah, okay, okay. Good, good, good. Get it, got it, good. I don't know what movie that's from, but it's from a movie. I'm a movie. I'm a movie. It's, like, it's Luigi that says that. Okay, you know what? Let's kill this guy because I feel like he's going to get in the way. Okay, here we go. Yes. Now, this is what I'm scared of, guys. This jump in particular is terrifying. Oh, okay, okay. Come on. Boulder energy. Come on. Let's do this thing. Oh god, I'm, I'm scared, fellas. Oh, that was so close! It was so close! A few moments later. Oh, I can feel the power of the boulders. Okay, come on. Alright, let's freaking do this. Oh yeah! Let's freaking go! <sighs> okay. <sighs> god damn, I'm nervous. Alright. Okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. Let's look at the pattern. So a, a bunch of stairs are going to spawn at the bottom. That's all I got to do. I just got to time this right. That's it. No, not when it's coming back. Okay, I need to basically hit it like now. And then go. Oh my god, we did it. We just did it. Yes! 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 We did it. Oh my god. We actually did it. I can't believe it. Let's go! Guys, we're gonna try Wobble and Rock. Let's give this one a shot. If you've never seen it, you guys saw the Wobble Rocks earlier on the in the other level. This time, we have to balance on the Wobble Rock without jumping. This one is stupid. Look how easy it is to fall. It's so easy to fall. This one is actually dumb. You have to basically immediately move to the correct spot and not mess up. You have to move a certain amount to the left or a certain amount to the right. And it's really hard to predict that because of how fast the boulder moves. Or, I'm sorry, this is a rock. This is clearly not a boulder. We don't appreciate rocks. Oh my god, you know what that means? There's only three left. Yes, the boulders have blessed us. But, will they bless us enough for these last three? I think I'm gonna try this one next. Alright, here we go. Here we go, fellas. That, okay, you know what? That was just <laughs> stupid. Okay, um, I need to learn the, uh, the patterns of the levels again. Or of this level in particular. I thought it was just a triple jump. Oh no, you have to do that first, okay. This part, I think I can just jump over all of this. Yes. Well, no. Let's honestly, let's just keep going. That part is dumb. I hate that part. I also hate all of this. That has to be like a perfect jump, also. 
you see how hard that is? I have to jump at the perfect height at the perfect time. And I have to be like running and also pray the spinies just aren't in the way. Absolutely absurd. Like genuinely absurd. Two hours later. Oh, oh my God, that spiny almost, uh, it almost destroyed me again. Dude, that like it. I did everything perfectly and like it too got in the way. I did everything right and they indicted me. <sighs> okay, let's just beat it. Just beat it. Who cares how good it is? No, okay, that's it, game over. Like I said, you might as well just throw the, th get the, mm, man, man. Okay, all right, let's try this again. Oh, oh, oh my God, we're gonna do one attempt. One attempt, <laughs> finally. It's a bronze, but we beat it. Oh, there's coins right there, okay. It took 36 minutes to get one good attempt, and it wasn't even a silver. It was a bronze. All right. I think this is the first one where I'm going to have to skip it for now. I might come back to it, but let's go ahead and try these last two. Now, this one, this one's ridiculous. You, Like I said, you have to do so much tech to get 60 seconds here. Stone slide tower climb? Oh, man, I don't know. You got to go re ridiculously fast for this one. Look, I'm already at bronze. I'm already at bronze. And there's only 10 seconds left. Yeah, I'm gonna have to watch the video again to figure out how to do this fast because I don't remember any of the strats. Oh, I might actually clear this though. Okay, I think I'm gonna clear it. Yippee, 87 seconds, I cleared it. I will give it a few more attempts, but honestly, I really don't know about this. This one is tough. <laughs> I hate that part. That jump in particular is so dumb. How do you get up there? I don't understand how to get up there. More moments later. Dudes, I am happy getting a silver. I am happy with a silver. Wow. I'm kind of shocked, actually. I'm actually kind of shocked we got a silver at all. Now, this one is also kind of the same thing where you need to have really, really good tech. Okay, I'm just going. I don't know the pattern at all. I don't know the route. But the route is also, like I said, very precise. Oh my god, get out of the way. Okay, I need to get up a lot higher. Ooh, that's a hard one. That is a hard one. How the heck? Okay, I actually have no idea how they did that. Oh, we did it. Okay, we did it. I'm wasting a lot of time now, but we did it once. And we'll jump off that. Okay, I'm figure I'm actually figuring out the route. That's kind of nuts. Also, this is dumb. This is dumb. Oh my god, how did I not die? Oh! Go, 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 go! Oh no! I missed the silver! But I got a PB. 